Hey everybody, Deb Knopfsinger, Program Supervisor for the Sandusky County Park District here with your next edition of Discover Your Neighborhood. Today's topic you may have seen hopping around your backyard. If you have a garden, you may be trying to keep this little guy from nibbling on your greens. If you guess the Eastern Cottontail, then you you are correct. So let's go see what we can learn about this furry, adorable little creature. So all you have to do is look at an Eastern Cottontail's tail to realize how they got their name. Rabbits are herbivores, which means they feed on plants. Rabbits use their front teeth to snip off vegetation. These front teeth never stop growing. Another interesting thing is that they have a second set of incisors directly behind the first set. These are called peg teeth. Herbivores do not have any canine teeth, but they do have molars. And these are flat so that they can grind their food up. So they can get as many nutrients out of their food as possible. Rabbits will actually eat their poop. Yes, I said it. They eat their poop. The first time their food goes through their body, they eat it. The second time, those are the droppings that you'll find outside. Contrary to popular belief, cottontails do not dig holes. Instead, they scratch out a shallow depression that they lay in, and this is called a form. Mother rabbits will build a shallow nest, which is only about five inches deep for her babies to stay in during the first month of their life. It's lined with fur and grass to keep the babies comfy and warm. The mother only visits the nest a couple times a day to nurse her babies. If you find a nest in your yard, remember the babies have not been abandoned. Mama is nearby. Females can have three to four litters per year with an average of five kits or bunnies per litter. Rabbits are crepuscular, which means you see them around dawn and dusk. If you do spot one and they spot you, their first instinct is to freeze. They won't move. If they want to get away, they'll run in a zigzag pattern and they can run up to 15 miles per hour. And we can't forget everybody's favorite rabbit, Nibbles. Many people think she's a cottontail rabbit, but she's a nature center rabbit. Actually, we're not sure what kind of rabbit she is, but we love her. So get outside and discover the cottontails in your neighborhood or stop out at the nature center and say hello to Nibbles.